excessive entertainment. Spending excessive time on mindless entertainment, such as binge watching TV shows or mindlessly scrolling through social media, can divert attention from productive and meaningful endeavors. A lot of people are on or invested in the social lands and are invested in a, a, a TV show lands. And, and they're so invested in those different things that those things are distracting them from extracting from the lands that will produce enough wheat that will produce bread in their lives. See, the beautiful thing about working your land is that when you work your land, whether it's your wife or your husband or your children or, or the other different things that are significant, then those different things will of themselves produce for you. But when we get into these fantasy worlds and we get into the social media land and, and the TV land and the Netflix land and the Hulu land and the Disney Plus lands, then those things become distractions or we get so caught up on what LeBron is doing or what 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 Wimby is doing or what what the what's going on in the NFL. That's why I don't watch much TV. I don't watch much shows because why am I going to watch other people make millions when I haven't made my first million yet? Why am I going to watch other people succeed in their work? Distracting me from my work. And so many people are invested on what other people doing in their lives based upon what they post. That they're not on their post as a husband. They're not on their post as a wife. They're not on their post as a parent. So could it be that one of the worthless lands that you're toiling, that you're cultivating, that you're that that's causing poverty in your life is excessive entertainment? So when you spend excessive time, notice I said excessive. There's nothing wrong with watching a game here or there. There's nothing wrong with watching a TV show uh, in 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 areas or the, in the realms of rest on a Sabbath or something like that. There's nothing wrong with that. But when that becomes your norm, to the point to where you're not even uh, in a place to perform and, and, and to ensure that your lands are in form, then my friend, you're going to find yourself in poverty. Could it be that the reason why you're not, the reason why you're not successful or the reason why your marriage is not thriving is because you're more focused on who's going to win a Super Bowl? Could it be that the reason why your marriage is not thriving because you're worrying about the housewives in these various cities? Could it be that the reason why your, your, your children are not getting the attention they need and they're always in detention at school is because you're giving all your attention of what's going on on other people's platforms and social media uh, uh, pages? And so you got to begin to think, am I pursuing excessive entertainment? It says such as binge watching TV shows or mindlessly scrolling. What could you be doing? What, what scriptures could you be scrolling through? What, what areas of life could you be scrolling through than mindlessly scrolling through social media, causing you to be not productive in meaningful endeavors? Let's, come, let's go to number two.